hey let today draw this pressure please that we see in front of us and it is in cast iron not gray cast iron and the sizes are in millimeters so what are we gonna do is we're gonna go on new thing okay let's give it a moment okay then from here we say matrix standard millimeter and then we go create so so once we are here on our drawing board we gonna start with the circle so that is my first circle okay this is my second and that is my third and i want the dimension of the of my biggest circle to be 128 128 millimeters all right and uh, my smallest one need to be 25 millimeters so that's one they need to be uh 25 millimeters okay and uh, this middle one need to be 78 okay so once i have those one day i'm gonna go for my hexagon since i need to have uh six circles day okay with uh same space between them so i need to make sure that uh, I get this done quickly okay so once i have my hexagon day then i'm gonna start by placing the circle so that is my first one okay so that is my first one there are two those are my first ones these are my second ones come on these are my second ones okay third ones i come here fourth ones fifth ones and this is my sixth ones okay so the next thing that i need to do is to give dimension so that one over there need to be 27 millimeters so that need to be 27 millimeters okay and this one here need to be uh 15 millimeters so that need to be 15. once i have those ones in place i'm gonna go there i say i press on equal then i want this one to be equal to that one okay I want that one to be equal to this one. I want this one to be equal to that. I want this one to be equal to this one. I want that one to be equal to this one. And the next thing is, I want that one to be equal. Come on, not you. Escape. Equal again. So I want this one here because, come on, my reference one is this one here. So I want this one here to be equal to that one. I want this one to be equal to this one here. <coughs> so I want this, this one here to be equal to that. I want that one to be equal to this and I want this to be equal to that okay so once those are in place I go escape the next thing that I want now is to delete this posture okay I don't need the hexagon anymore because it was just for guidance okay it was just for guidance so once I have everything in place then I don't need it so then I'm gonna go for these other circles okay these are this these are the circles so that is my first one okay and uh this is my second one so now the dimension from the up to the that's one need to be uh 2.5 millimeters so that's need to be 2.5 millimeters okay and now from the to v that's one need to be five millimeters okay five millimeters now i don't need this circle now because it was for my pcd to get the the diameter of my circles okay and then i'm gonna go on trim i wanna take this out i need that one out this one out this one out that one out this one out i don't need this i don't need that i don't need one i don't need this i don't need that i don't need this i don't need this one i don't need that one i don't need this one i don't need that one i don't need this one i don't need that one okay so i have to remove this one yeah okay i don't need this one i don't need that one I don't need this one yeah I don't need this I don't need that I don't need this I don't need that I don't need this I don't need that yeah the same thing so I need to remove those one and that one as well as you know those ones so once done I say okay okay I can say finish sketch or whatever my sketch is there so I go on 3d model I say extrude now so I want to extrude this port here I'm gonna start by this port I want this this port here by seven parameters as well as that one they need to go together by seven millimeters so those ones they need to be excluded by seven millimeters okay so that's one in place i say okay and then the next thing that i want i want to come here and say sketch visibility on i right click 
then I say visibility on then I turn my sketch I come on extrude again I need to get this pot here out that's one day this one here that's one here this one that's one and that's one those one here need to be extruded by 37 millimeters or 37 millimeters and I make sure that it is extruded by 37 millimeters okay the way it is there then I say okay and the next thing that I need now I need these ones here to be taken out okay this pot here so I come on extrude again okay so I make sure that I'm selecting the right pot so I come here I select that spot over there okay I select uh, this pot over there okay I select that spot okay this one as well right I select that one and then I come for this one so once that is in place once I've selected those ones then I need to give them dimension so that's those ones need to be uh 25 millimeters they need to be selected by 25 millimeters so let's see they need to be extruded by 25 millimeters that's correct so now I need to take this part out I need to take this out. sorry this part needs to be taken out okay so now I turn it then I say extrude okay and then I select the port which is this one here great then it needs to be extruded with 15 millimeters so 15 millimeters so I can either change it today or change it today the same thing so I select that one man I put 15 millimeter then and I say okay okay so now your drawing is done but you need now to kill the corners I need to kill that one over there so what I'm gonna do is I click on the corner first let me remove the visibility so I come on visibility I say visibility off and then I select the corner so my first corner okay then I select all of them at once okay so this one as well let me turn it properly so this one here was once that's one done and then I come here I select uh, that spot that one this one that one that one this one this one that one this one here the one over V this one that one uh, this one here that one this one that one this one that one so I need to make sure that all the corners are key out so this one here that one that one this one that one that one and uh what next so this one and that one and that one and that one and that one so the outside ones those are the ones that i want to kill so that one okay and this one great so now that's all the corners are killed all the outside corners are killed okay so that's correct and then i see no 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 i need to kill it with one millimeter radius 1.5 millimeter radius like that i say okay okay so now give it a moment for you to operate so that's correct so now that everything is done i need to choose the material so this one here need to be in cast iron okay so gray cast iron i come the and then i go for iron gray okay so there is your pressure plate do you see how beautiful it looks this is what we did so it was a pleasure of mine sharing this video with you i hope that you guys enjoyed it i hope that you're gonna enjoy it for now i'm gonna ask you to take care of yourselves and see you on the next videos please if you haven't subscribed just click on the button that's easier and subscribe to the channel for now i'm gonna ask you to take care of yourself and I'll say bye see you